Hi! So I'll give you five seconds to enumerate the persons that you love the most. Three persons. Okay? One, two, three, four, and five. Time's up. Sa tatlong tao na binanggit mo, nandoon ka ba? Jesus said, love your neighbors as you love yourselves. But do you love yourself? Sa inerasyon natin ngayon, madalas mong maririnig yung mga katagang, ayaw ko nang maging ako, galit ako sa sarili ko. Diba? It's so hard to be kind to ourselves, to be patient with ourselves. Ako personally, I hated myself, myself rather, for three years. Tatlong taon ko, akong galit sa sarili ko. Kasi hindi ko nakikita siya nakamahal-mahal. Na nakaka-guilty maging masaya. Nakaka-guilty na tumawa. Kasi parang hindi dapat. And maybe some of you right now, ganun din yung nararamdaman. It's so hard for us to love someone else. Kasi hirap din tayong mahalin yung sarili natin. And that's the thing. It's so hard to love ourselves kasi baka kulang na yung pagmamahal lang natin yung meron. Thankfully, I grew up in the United Methodist Church and there's this song na madalas pinapatugtog. Sabi niya, Oh, I love you with the love of the Lord. So why not? Why not let, let us love ourselves with the love of the Lord? Now, if you cannot see yourself as lovable, as someone na valuable, hindi mo makita sa pamagitan ng mga mata mo din, try to see the perspective of God. Kasi mahal ka niya. And this Holy Week, ito yung pinaka-proof kung gaano tayo kamahal ng Diyos. Hindi niya lang sinabi, but He acted upon it. He suffered for our sins. He died for our sins. He died for you and me. A sinner, an imperfect being. So maybe, just maybe, try to love yourself with the love of the Lord. And siguro, we can also love our neighbors through that. From there, we can love our neighbors right. We can be patient to them. We can be kind to them. We won't get jealous to their achievements. We can love them truly. Kasi we love ourselves na. Alam na natin kung paano mahalin ang sarili natin. Kaya alam na rin natin kung paano natin mamahalin ang ating mga kapitbahay, ang ating mga kapatid, and even the strangers out there. But if you are a person right now na who's struggling to love yourself, to find value sa sarili mo, I just want to pray for you. Let's pray. Father God Almighty, we are acknowledging your presence right now, God. Panginoon, alam namin na kahit magkalayo kami ng distansya right now, Father, na kahit pagitan ay sa screen, God, na you are here with us, Father. Alam mo yung struggles namin. Alam mo yung hirap namin mahalin yung mga sarili namin. Hirap kaming mag-find ng kahalagahan sa sarili namin. Parang hindi namin deserve na mahalin yung sarili namin. But Lord, thank you. Kasi pinapaalala mo sa amin na kamahal-mahal kami. Na despite na makasalanan kami, Panginoon, minahal mo kami. You even died for us. Pinuhat mo lahat ng sakit na kami dapat ang makakatanggap, Panginoon. And we are so thankful for that, Lord. Muli, Panginoon, we are praying, tulungan mo kami na magmahal at mahalin ang sarili namin, Panginoon. Nang sa gayon, matuto kami kung paano dapat ituring at mahalin yung mga neighbors namin, Father. Lord, thank you very much. Thank you very much because you are our God. Because you die for our sins, you suffer for our sins, and still you live again, Panginoon. You rise from the dead. This is all our prayer in Jesus' mighty name.